Welcome to Sports. I'm Jordan Strack. We are out at Highland Meadows in Sylvania and moving day is now complete. Three days done here at the Marathon Classic and Nasa Hadayoka continues to be the story. After everybody kind of reeled her in yesterday, she went off today and she will now take a six shot lead into Sunday's final round. Fans were on full force today. A wonderful crowd out at Highland Meadows, a welcome sight for everyone, and they were treated to a show. One of the bright young stars on tour, the 20 year old rookie. She won the US Open, Yuka Sasso. She shot 64 today, this on 17. Actually her third on the par five. She would put it in close and she would make the birdie putt. She is 11 under. One of the other young stars chasing, Esther Henselet, the German on number four. She's had three really solid days here. Shoots 67 today. She is at 12 under. She will be in the second to last group on Sunday. Then it's Harioka. She tore the place up on Thursday and she did it again today. After a bogey on three, this is her second shot on number four. She would finish that up for a birdie putt. She was at 12 under. Then it's Mina Haragai. Hoping for one of those final Solheim Cup spots that is up for grabs. She started out on fire, making birdies on four of her first six holes today. This on number four, she'd make a really tough downhill putt. She's at 13 under. She is in that final group tomorrow. And joining her in that final group, Elizabeth Zokel. She's put together three really solid days here. 67, 66, 67. This on 18, she would chip it up close and then make the birdie. She is at 13 under. She is tied for second. But everyone is chasing Nasa Harayoka. She's had a historic week so far. Shoots 64 today. She is now 19 under for the tournament. That is the best 54 hole score in the history of the Marathon Classic. She's got a six shot lead and she is in great position to win the title. When I first was here, it was my rookie year, and I really played awful. So I now, when I'm playing the way I am right now, it really makes me think how much I grew, how better I've gotten. But right now, I'm not going to think about the winning. I'm just going to concentrate to play the best. I'd say just keep playing how I'm playing. I feel like I've made a lot of birdies and keep, do, keep doing the same thing, just fairies and greens and get some putts to drop. You've seen the scores out here. Um, some girls, I mean, you can go really low out here, but... Um, and you, you just never know. Golf's a funny game, so I think if I just you know, keep my head down and keep going forward, you know, um, it might pan out. <laughs> I can only influence what I'm doing, and I'm just trying to focus on myself as I did the last few days, and just to kind of grow with the experience and learn from it and enjoy myself tomorrow. All right, here's a look at the leaderboard. There are 14 players that are 10 under or better. Stacy Lewis is one of those golfers at 10 under, but everyone on this list has an uphill climb tomorrow trying to chase down Nasa Harayoka and her six shot lead. With the unpredictability of the weather for Sunday, they have moved the leaders tee times up to 920 AM. So they will have all the leaders going off bright and early tomorrow trying to get this tournament in on Sunday. Nasa Harayoka will try for a wire to wire championship here at the Marathon Classic. And that is it for sports.